Hello everybody, it's Katie here and welcome back to my channel. Today it's a Thursday and I have actually a pretty big weekend coming up. Like I have things to do tomorrow night and Saturday night and even Sunday. And so I wanted to do like a little self care tonight um, to make sure I'm well rested and making sure like my mindset is right. And so I wanna lead you guys through what a nighttime self care routine looks like. Before I say all like the products that I'm using and what I'm doing for self care, I wanna say self care is a lot to do with your mindset as well. Say these quick fixes and these products will definitely help set me and relax me um, and help clear my mind and making sure I'm having like a lot of me time but at the same time self-care goes a lot beyond uh, you know like 10 minute routines and stuff making sure you're also taking care of your mind you're taking rest days if you guys need also exercising you're going for walks daily the biggest part about self-care is having a routine and being in a habit I think that's when I feel my best self is when I have a routine and a habit and a rhythm of doing things. Every single product that you guys see here, you guys can actually find on iHerb.com. iHerb has over 30,000 products on their site. And plus, iHerb is celebrating their 25th anniversary in the month of September, so they're doing a lot of great discounts. I know the month is about to end, so make sure you check it out before the deals end. It's gonna be linked down below if you guys wanna check out these products too. Let's get into my routine. Okay, first things first, I'm gonna get the bath running. The bath is kinda loud, sorry, but as it fills up, I'm going to remove my makeup with these Mild by Nature Aloe Cucumber Facial Wipes. Let's do it. Oh my God, they smell delicious, you guys. They smell like those washcloths that you get at a resort. <laughs> I changed into a bathing suit because obviously, I'm not gonna be here out here on YouTube and not in a bathing suit when I get in the tub. In the bathtub are these bath crystals and basically they're from Sunday Rain. I obviously got them on iHerb. They are acai berry extract infused sea salts. Hello from me and my bath. Right now, as I record this video, I feel like I am doing the opposite of self-care because I'm like, we're doing a YouTube video as I'm sitting in a bath because usually when I take a bath, that is like absolute me time without my phone or anything. And I feel like the best thing about self-care, the best thing that you guys can do is spending time with yourself. Dr. Gonzalez, who actually came on my show, Austin AF, uh, very recently, he was saying how he spends every single morning for one hour without his phone, it's whether that's 15 minutes, but you learn so much about yourself in that time. And so I think spending time in a bath is actually a great way to force you to spend time alone, especially with like some crystals and doing something like eye patches and putting my hair up in a hair mask or something like that. So it forces me to be alone because I leave my phone in another room and obviously I'm in the bath right now so I'm not gonna like get up and go get it right away. Sometimes when I'm really, really anxious, I need a self-care hour or a self-care day. But at the same time, I want to make sure you guys are always keeping up with your self-care because it's something that needs maintenance. It's something that needs practice. It's just like if you were an athlete and you needed to practice your sport every single day. If you are someone like me who struggles with anxiety, you need to practice it. You need to practice your relaxation, your meditation, and your stress levels every day so it does not get to that point of breaking. If you add in self-care nights, self-care mornings, or anything small throughout your day to make sure you're upkeeping it, as I'm talking, these eye patches are heavenly, you guys. They're the hydrogel eye patches uh, from iHerb, and they honestly feel so delightful on my eyes. I usually use them if I'm going to a meeting early in the morning or something early in the morning, and I want to just like kind of wake up a little, but they feel so good right now. And now it is time to shower. Let's actually take a poll. Write in the comments, do you guys shower after your baths? Because I think showering after baths is huge, and I think we all should shower after baths. I'm gonna use this Petal Fresh Pure Smoothing Body Scrub. Smooths, hydrates, and softens. You guys, it smells so good. It is coconut and I'm obsessed with it. I again got it from iHerb, so I'm gonna shower with it now. Post shower, I am using this raw shea butter lotion. I'm obsessed with shea butter lotion, you guys. First off, it smells so good. It is so thick and creamy. I lathered up throughout my entire body. So again, I'm not gonna show you guys that on camera because I'm a little weird, but I will show you guys the texture of it right here. 
I actually have this lotion next to my soap because every time I wash my hands or like have a lot of hand sanitizer these days, my hands get really dry. So I rub in this shea butter lotion after my shower. It actually doesn't have that potent of a smell. Sometimes shea butter can be very, very potent. But at this time, this is like a really natural, nice, like very light smell as well, which I absolutely love. I don't love an overpowering lotion fragrance. I got that from iHerb and now I'm actually going to cook myself a really nice dinner. So come downstairs with me. For dinner, I am making a veggie pasta. It's actually going to be with a cauliflower cream sauce. You guys are gonna be obsessed with this. With edamame fettuccine pasta that I got from iHerb and I obsessed with this pasta, you guys. I probably have this pasta two times a week and this is a really bold statement, but I actually enjoy this pasta almost more than real pasta, but hot take. Anyways, here is what it looks like from iHerb, and now let's get into the recipe. <laughs> I cut up some cauliflower. I have my boiling water over here. Y'all can't see it really, but I'm gonna put my cauliflower in the boiling water, and then I'm gonna roast some vegetables. Basically, what we have on this platter is onions, broccoli, and kale. I'm gonna throw them all in the saute pan right here. We got our veggies here in the saute pan and cauliflower boiling. Next, I'm seasoning the veggies with some garlic powder and onion powder. Cauliflower is soft and boiled. I'm gonna drain it and put it in a blender. And here's what I'm putting inside. Basil, Parmesan, garlic. I'm using oat milk. You guys can use any milk alternative. And then some olive oil, salt, pepper, onion powder, and garlic powder. Kind of looks like soup. It is perfect consistency for a kind of basil cauliflower cream sauce. All right, so now that I have my edamame pasta cooked, I have my veggies prepared and the sauce made, I'm going to combine it all. I also want to remind you guys something huge about self-care is taking your vitamins. Two vitamins that really help, I personally believe, think that help my immune system a lot are zinc and elderberry. So like I said, iHerb has so many different products and they have a lot of different vitamins to choose from. Time to take more vitamins. And after dinner, I am back upstairs in my bedroom. I'm having a very early night tonight. Actually, one of my friends are about to come over for a little bit more self-care. Um, and obviously love to moisturize my face, but don't ever forget to moisturize your lips too. Is this e.l.f. mint balm, again, I got it at iHerb, especially after dinner, it's so nice to put on your lips. So be sure to check the links in my description box for all the products that I mentioned in this video. I do have a small code that you guys can use. I will put it right here and again, put it below. Once again, this video is sponsored by iHerb, so huge shout out to them. Now I'm going to enjoy some friend time, so make sure to like, comment, subscribe to my channel for more weekly videos. Bye y'all.